Yo, yo, what are we about to do? What are we about to do? Graduate? Yeah. Graduate? 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 Occasion. And I would like to thank all of you for being here. This is a, this is a truly special day for not only me, but the class of 2016. First, I want to thank my teachers, my friends, and most importantly, my family for challenging me into becoming a better person in and out of school. The competition I had in the classroom with my peers gave me extra motivation to succeed academically. They absolutely made it harder for me to get to where I am. But honestly, I never thought I would be in this position. In middle school, my grades weren't that great. I was a B student and I was grieving my mother's death. She died due to cancer when I was nine years old. So it took me a while to accept it. She was always strict with me in terms of doing well in school, even in the Philippines. That's why when I transitioned into high school, I made a vow to myself that I would fulfill my mom's vision. My mom wanted me to become the best student I could be. I have. Okay. However, not only did my mother play a huge role in my life, my father did as well. He's here today, somewhere in those seats. And I want to thank him. Thank him for everything he's done and sacrificed for me. Being a single parent is no joke. And I commend all of the other parents who are in the same position. Without my father, I wouldn't be here. I wouldn't be able to stand here in front of you making this speech. So dad, Please stand up and show everyone who you are. hasn't been easy. We all have our own struggles and we know our school has its ups and downs. But I don't want to focus on the negative side. I don't know about you guys, but this senior year was the best year we've had. Even if you don't realize it, we all got closer together. Shout out to the senior six. <laughs> Um, we made unforgettable memories. Whether it was scaring people in the haunted house, or the amazing prom night we all had. We definitely had memories that we will never forget. 
This class will forever be bonded. And no one can take that away from us. Look at the person next to you. He or she will always remain a part of your life. They are the people with whom you spent your high school, high school years with. That's, that's why someday in the future, we will, be, we will be telling stories to our friends and families about our high school days. Whether you like it or not, there'll be bumps in the roads. And it is our job to go over it. I don't want to sound cliche, but this is not the end. Graduation is simply the beginning. After you walk out of here with your diploma, the real world kicks in. We will be faced with being adults. Whether you're going to college, the military, or going straight into the workforce, we will be faced with life-changing decisions. However, I'm not worried about that. Because I know for a fact that every single one of you will succeed in your own way. Of course, there will be failures here and there, but that's what makes us stronger. I believe in all of us, and I believe in you. So right now, I challenge you, the class of 2016, to do all that you can do all that you can do to reach your full potential as a student and as a person. And to the end of speech, I want to make one last memory with you. Let's take a selfie. Ezekiel Del Rosario. Yeah.